Messi. Surging forward with real menace here. Brilliant from Messi. Oh, what a goal that is! And his quick feet and his balance and his composure. Absolutely superb. So guys, welcome to this How to Play Like Messi episode. Now, if we want to play like the magician, we've got to learn his strong points quick. And as you guys know, he is the best in the world at dribbling with the ball close to his body. So how did he learn it and how are we going to learn it? Well, to start off with, you have to practice all the time in a tight area, just keeping control of the ball. So loads of little touches. I'm going to demonstrate now. So using both of your feet, loads of little touches. The closer, the closer you can keep that ball to your feet, the better. Okay, loads of little touches, left and right, in and out, turning, twisting. So that's first of all what we need to do. Keep control of the ball, work on getting that ball glued to your foot. So that's phase one, keeping the ball glued to your foot. Once you've mastered that, you're ready for phase two. What's phase two? How do you beat your opponent? Now it's not easy. Messi doesn't use all the razzle and dazzle skills. He don't need to. He's got the best trick in the book, which is how to drop his shoulder. If you master that, you don't need all the step overs. Trust me. So this is how we do it. of the shoulder it's classic messy and if you guys want to improve on it make sure you work on your balance coordination and your agility now I'm going to tell you guys a story about when I worked with Ashley Cole he was playing against Lionel Messi two weeks later in the Champions League and I said to him Ash how are you going to defend against Lionel Messi and he said well I'm the best left back in the world and it's easy he's going to cut in so as it happens a week later I was filming with Messi and I said Messi Ashley Cole said he knows what you're going to do next week in the Champions League. He knows that you are going to cut in every time. His reply to me was, it's not if, but it's when. And what that tells us is, if you master this technique, it doesn't matter if the defenders know you're going to cut inside. When you cut inside, you'll do it so well, they'll be chasing your shadows. Even if, let's say for instance, which didn't happen, Ashley Cole knows he's going to cut inside, he's got the skill to get out of that. I mean, his ball control is so close to his feet, he can change directions just like when he twisted up Jerome Boateng, and this is how it looks. Surging forward with real menace here, brilliant from Messi, oh what a goal that is! And the whole of this ground stands! So let's move on to how Messi crosses and passes the ball. He likes to use the inside of his foot and get a slight bit of curl onto the ball. The reason why he does this is purely because that's his most accurate pass. Now, from crossing, that can be deadly because he puts that ball in the corridor of uncertainty in between the CGR box and the penalty area. The keeper can't come out for it, defenders are running back and often it leads to a goal. Oh, oi, oi. I've never seen Jezza do a diving header before. I live to see it all. Messi with the assist. Again. So let's move on to the free kicks. Now when Messi takes a free kick, he likes to use the inside of his foot. That tells us that he's not going for power, he's not going for a knuckleball technique, he's going for placement and accuracy only. He very rarely strikes across the ball into the far corner. He likes to go over the wall and dip it down into the near post. His run-ups are very short and also very side-on. Most people take it from about here. Messi, side-on. Let's see if I can copy it. If you notice, Messi likes to run directly at his defenders. What this does, it forces them to commit, and that's when he makes his move. Go! Messi loves to attack the space with his first touch, putting his opponent on the back foot straight away. Let's move on to Messi's control. Now when he's taking his first touch, he always makes sure that he controls the ball with the foot that's furthest away from his opponent. Just like that. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out! Oh! <laughs> Mitch! <laughs> Mitch, talk to us, talk to us. Let's go. So guys, we hope you enjoyed this learn how to play like Lionel Messi tutorial. What we want to know from you guys is who do you want us to do next? 
put your star player in the comment section below and we'll see if we can do it. Arrivederci. I can't talk seriously like this, Jez. So guys, we hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> Bill, it's so funny, man. All right. We'll get the stance right. Yeah, you got to get the stance right. Yeah, you got to get into the mind frame, haven't you? Of yeah. bothered, bothered. <laughs> yeah, that's it. So, guys. <laughs> <laughs>